And I want to come back to something because you were talking about the head tilt and we spoke only about the, going, the axis up and down. Sure. What do you think about the head tilt? Because I've, I've dealt with this with a lot of clients and had a lot of discussions about the power of speaking this way and speaking this way. What are your thoughts about it? So there isn't much on it, to my knowledge. Uh, so the movement you're talking about is something called head roll rotation, opposed to head pitch rotation. Um, but the, what I have seen is it, it can also increase uh, perceptions of affiliativeness and warmth. Um, but other than that, uh, from my experience with it, I haven't seen too much. Oh, and that's interesting because I've often thought that tilting your head takes away some power. And again, I'm not using research for this. But speaking with many of my clients, they've told me that they use that as a listening behavior. And it makes a lot of sense because you're taking away some power by looking less strong with the head tilted to the side, and it may make somebody feel more comfortable. Sure. So I often coach my clients to be mindful of what you can communicate. It doesn't mean there's a right or wrong because certain situations dictate looking very powerful and prestigious. And maybe when you're speaking to your manager or certain situations, you may not want to be the person of power and choose to have maybe low power postures. Does that make sense? Absolutely. So, you know, recognizing your part you know, I like to talk of it in terms of social hierarchies, which it, it seems a bit removed when you're talking about social interactions, but it, it's actually pivotally important. And recognizing your um, position in a social hierarchy is absolutely central. So, for example, if you're talking to a boss um, and uh, you're trying to come across as like a high-ranking person, this can sometimes be good because it can make them want to promote you, but also it can be threatening and it can definitely have some, uh, lead to some issues. So uh, knowing when to signal your social rank versus knowing when to be more submissive mm -hmm. um, is very important for maintaining comfortable power dynamics. Mm -hmm.